I recently, it was my birthday in February, and so a group of gals, uh, most of my friends from Canada actually came down. We went to Palm Springs, mm -hmm. and my best friend Leslie and I were like, what are we gonna do? First of all, booze luge. That's the first thing we want. It was like a giant ice sculpture. A booze luge? A booze luge, right? So like a giant ice sculpture. It's like in the shape of a, like a pinball machine and you pour like vodka in it and then you drink it out the other side. So we were so excited and then we realized we're like, we're only here for three days. This is a 750 pound block of ice. This thing's not gonna melt by the time we're ready to go. Right. Scratch the booze luge. Then we think bouncy castle. That's a natural next step from the booze luge. No, it's not, right? but okay. Um, not at all. Uh, but then we couldn't get it in the backyard. The fence was, the gate was too small. So then I was like, I guess penis cake. I guess that's like the next logical step. I like know? how there's, I don't see one connection no. from one. No one goes from bouncy castle to penis cake. No. And if they do, they should be arrested. Well, true, very true. Um, <laughs> but then, I, you know, I haven't been married before. I've never had a bachelorette party. So I was like, maybe I should do the penis cake. And then I thought, you know what, no. I am a beautiful woman in her prime. It's my birthday, I'm celebrating me. I want a cake made in the likeness of my own butt. I have a great butt. You have a good butt? I have a great butt. It's pristine, it's beautiful. Anyway, and so I said to my boyfriend, I was like, would you be comfortable doing a photo shoot of my butt in a thong for me to send to a baker so that he can make a cake in the likeness of my butt? And there was not even a hesitation. He just looked me in the eye and he said, absolutely. And I was right. like, this is the guy. That's the That's guy. That's good guy. Right? Yeah. Anyway, he was yeah. like, you had me at, will you take a picture? Yeah. <laughs> he got his like special camera out with like a big lens. Like I, I think, yeah, it was a thrill. Uh, was a now, thrill. wait a minute. So you posed for this picture. Correct. And, and then you sent this picture of your uh, posterior Thank you. to a baker. Correct, yes. And the baker worked from that and made, <laughs> was it an accurate representation? It was stunningly accurate, like almost creepy. Okay. Yeah. And when I went in, he was like, whose butt is it? I was like, mine. And he was like, okay. And I was like, that's all I get? Okay. Yeah. Like, you can fake it, man. Be yeah. like, wow, really impressive. No. We, uh, you, you brought a picture of the cake. I did, yeah. Let's take a look at the yeah, cake. Take a look this at is it. the there cake. It is. It's fantastic. It's nice. And see, I, my best friend and I planned this together. We didn't tell any of the other girls. So one night after dinner, uh, I, we went into the bedroom. I, I stripped down, I put on the same thong that I was wearing in the cake photo. And, uh, and so I put, went like face down, ass up on the bed beside the cake. And so then my, my Leslie goes and she's like, okay, she's ready. And, and all the girls filed in. And I assumed there'd be like screaming or squeals or whatever, but it literally there was like a hushed tone and people were like, oh, wow, that is beautiful. Wow. <laughs> like it was like they were looking at diamonds. Like they yeah. were just like, oh, that's just, it's so accurate. Wow. <laughs> they had a real artistic, uh, you know, appreciation. And side by side, it's stunning. Yeah. Yeah. We've managed to keep that off the internet though, which I think is for the best. Uh, it'll, get, it'll, it'll get out there. Uh, <laughs>